Alright, so I was looking at YouTube at one time, and I found this video um, of an 8-channel um, relay controller linked to a Raspberry Pi. Now, thanks to this guy's YouTube video, I bought my own stuff and built it up, as you can see here. <laughs> Fairly neat setup. Um, as you can see on the first relay, I've connected it to this light back here. Now I've written an app in Java which uses the uh, Pi4j project and on my phone this app takes a little while to boot up because it also controls my robot which I'm halfway through building. However, there you go. You can see that it's got controls for all the relays. Now there's uh, this server software running on the Pi, and it's hooked up to the network. So when I press a button on here, the light goes off. Now there's nothing hooked up to the rest of the relays, so when I hit the others, they'll flick on and off, but they don't really control anything yet. So this is taken to 230 volt direct from main supply into the relays. You can see that the uh, same input goes across all of the relays, so I'm hoping to power different lights from the same input. Um, the Pi is powered by the 5 volt phone charger. Uh, each relay is controlled by one of these cables along here. They're also powered by the Pi. Um, using that jumper. If I was to take that off, I could put a, a separate relay um, power source on there. So, that's a kind of update one. We'll see where it goes from here. I was thinking about putting some lights behind the uh, screens and perhaps having a uh, motion sensor so it turns on when I sit down or, or perhaps even just running the program when I log onto my computer so it turns all the lights on behind. Alright, thanks for watching.